So going forward here, I'm going to be actually taking out these high deck cost cards like Zoa and the, can you close the door? And the, um, the spells I put in. You may have beaten me, but I doubt you'll survive a duel with my nephew, Yugi. So he's his uncle in this. He's his uncle. We've dueled your uncle in this submission. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> For some reason, I'm just going to start quoting a bridge now, and it's it's not funny, I know. It's, it's okay. Only three red rose cards left to collect. Oh, hell in a handbasket. It's, it's all of your fangirl's favorite character, Bakura. And look at that red armor, too. Like, damn. Yeah. <laughs> He's actually the first person that really uh, tripped me up my first time through the game. Because he has, as you can see, a very, very low deck cost. Lower than what our deck started out with. So I'm actually going to have to uh, make some significant changes in order to actually be able to even fight him. So, out goes... Uh, let's see. Zoa... Out goes Copycat, Fissure, Fissure, Fairy Mega Crush. And unfortunately, I've got to take more out too. Take out Google. <laughs> yeah, they got the 5 that cost card. Uh, I want things that will get a bonus on the forest though, so. Yeah, one Empress Judge is coming out. That's coming out. You're coming out too. Okay. So we're gonna. No. <laughs> Let's actually we can sort our cards by deck cost. So if we go up to the top, we're gonna put in that fake trap. And put another griggle. That I had in there before. Yeah, screw. It, we're gonna put that in there. I think it's five. Five fifty-seven is his deck cost. He lost a shield. That actually might be good uh, for some unexpected damage, so we'll put that in. Thunder, I don't have anything that can really be powered up by that. Unless I make Mystical Sand, which I can Zone Eater. <gasps> that actually will be really good for destroying the uh, the uh, crush. the crush terrain, so yeah, we'll throw that in there too. And we have our... <laughs> that actually didn't take as long as I thought it would. I thought that would be a struggle to... Uh, uh, throw our deck together in a way where we could actually fight him. <sighs> uh, I'm not looking forward to this. So, Bakura is Jack Cade of Mortimer, which I really don't know who... He says, you stand on Celt soil where the card dueling has been passed for generations. <laughs> and, oh, get Art of the Dark, yeah, okay. dark Duel. So well, he, is, he gonna, is he going to send me to the Shadow Realm now? I bet you just might. You just might. Alright, so... Makora's terrain, as you can see, has a lot of crush and forest, and he has a lot of uh, plant-type monsters. The nastiest thing about this bastard, though, is his deck leader, because it's a plant-type Secretary of Defense, and it has deck leader abilities out the ass. It has life points recovery. He will gain 50 life points every turn, no matter what. Um, destroy a specific enemy type, which is really, really powerful. Um, spellbind specific enemy type is very, very stupidly powerful. So, um, I'm actually going to wait to get... Uh, Hitatsumi Giant try to just rush his death. I think he also has um, increased movement range. He can move two spaces. No. Okay, I think he can't. That's good because I'm gonna try to attack him. Yeah, his um his deck leader as well. Um yeah, there he goes getting life points. His deck leader is Dark Plant, which is definitely a card that I want to get, because that's one of the cards I was talking about where it's destroyed by battle again. It uh, causes the terrain to turn to crush. I'm gonna thin out my deck just a little. Actually, I don't want to not be able to play that. Mm. Yeah, I'll wait. Yeah, I'm not messing around when it comes to this. Oh, it's gonna be a jerk now. I can still hit him now. I have a lot of monsters actually that are gonna be able to go over the crush terrain, and Hitatsu Mi Giant definitely takes the cake because he's a beast warrior. He can move on the um, crush terrain, he gets a power bonus on the. Uh, 
what do you call it? On the forest. So, already we got some good damage on the board. I don't care if whatever he has is going to be able to attack me. I'm not especially worried about it. I don't think it will, though. Despite his low deck cost, he can actually get out some mean monsters, too. Rip. <laughs> it's a fire grass. Fuck you. Alright, so without any hesitation, we're just gonna attack him again. I'm just, I'm not messing around with him. I am ready for this to be done. Hmm. That uh, uh, actually wasn't, wasn't a great idea, but we still destroyed it. I just didn't get any damage off of it. <laughs> Okay. We're still winning. By a lot. I'm sorry. I lost it. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> he knows not what he says. Only after I say. Take back some of those life points you've been gaining, fool. Yeah, fuck you and your life point gaining. <laughs> you sure you want to come after me now? Apparently he does. He's very adamant of coming after he touches me, giant. Okay. That's the thing. It's a laughing flower. He's attacked me directly twice now. He's probably a little stop right now. Yeah, he needs to have some chill. He's very lacking in the chill department right now. Watch a movie day when you're back and put it in this place. So if all the ones in the deck have a chance to um, return. Yeah, I'm gonna change this whole column into C so nothing gets a train bonus when it tries to attack me. Oh, you little jerk. He just gained back the life points I took from him. <laughs> That's what makes Bakura such a right pain in the butt. Yes, thank you for not putting anything in my way so I can attack you again. Oh! <laughs> it's going the other direction. Okay. It's horizontal spaces, not vertical spaces. I looked at it wrong. It actually means we have a crumb monster in our hand. That oh, do, do we play the Amazon of the Sea against, uh, uh, or that other thing against the... We suicided with it, didn't we? Like, so we don't have it anymore. Well... Okay, well, we're still okay. We can use that. There's some good damage in. Take back some more of those life points. And now I think we can almost finish him. Actually, we will be able to finish him because... Unless there's some kind of trap. Okay, we're good. We win. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 I actually do not know what his specific destruction or spellbinding is for his deck leader, and I don't think I want to know, because it sounds terrifying. It tends to be for monsters that are opposite of what, like... Whatever it is, yeah, I realize that, but yeah. I just, I don't, so I don't know what the opposite of the plan would be. Alright, so let's try to win Dark Plan here, because it's going to be very, very handy later on. Yay, I got it! <laughs> First try. What's bad in Forest? Rocks. What's bad in Forest? Um, uh, Fiends. But... Maybe it is fancy. If I can get three dark plants in a row, I will get something good. Ah! I am so terrible at the slot machine on camera. Oh, camera, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> so don't record me while I'm gambling. <laughs> mm. No, no way. Da da da. That's like triple oh, exclamation points too. Yep. All right. Oh, God. There he is. The final battle. Well, Yugi. Kinda. Henry the Seventh. Kinda. 